The ministerial nominees were screened by the Senate after feeding questions relating to national interest in their fields of specialization. The nominee from Oshun State, Adewole Isaac Folorin Shaw, a former vice chancellor of the University of Ibadan and a medical director, answered questions on medicine and education. Zenap Shinsuna Ahmed, an accountant by profession, a ministerial nominee from Kaduna State, answered question on oil and gas sector. What we need to do is to educate everybody that the most important person is the Nigerian citizen, either as a healthy person or as a sick person. And when we all recognize that without that person, there will be no health care system, we will have nothing to do with the jobless, then we will reattune ourselves to taking care of the interests of this Nigerian. How do we make these miners uh, practice better mining in, in the various areas where they are? How do we help them by giving them improved tools and implements so that the environment is not degrade, uh, degraded, so that our water is not polluted, so that what they earn from these mining activities actually sustains their livelihood? If we take it from that angle, then we will be more inclined to bring in development to those areas where this illegal mining is concentrated. After screening the six ministerial nominees, the Senate President Bukola Saraki returns to the upper seat at the plenary to report progress to the Senate and later adjourned the ministerial screening to Wednesday, October 28, 2015. In all, 31 ministerial nominees have so far been screened, while 18 have been confirmed as ministers of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Adesua Lato reporting.